Good evening and greetings from Bien Hoa in Vietnam and the general chapter of the Friars of the Dominican Order. Today is Thursday the 18th of July and we are now entering a very interesting phase of the chapter. Having had the election of the Master of the Order, Father Gerard Timone, uh, last Saturday, we're now in the major work of the commissions of the Order. The members of the chapter have divided into commissions to tackle different areas of our Dominican life, our governance, how we live together, and how we want to tackle the problems in the church and our mission to spread the good news of Jesus Christ today in our world. There are several commissions. One would be, for example, on vocations and formation, which is about how we welcome young men into our order and how we form them and train them to be missionaries today and good brothers in our communities. Another commission on solidarity, another one on collaboration between the different entities of the order, and all this work in the commissions is very detailed, but must also try and communicate between the other commissions to get this global perspective. The order is present more or less all over the world and works in many different languages. So this is quite a, an interesting moment. I'm an interpreter. I work between French and English. And so today and the last few days, my work has been in the commission on study. And study is an integral, absolutely essential part of our Dominican life. All Dominicans study, and we study for our whole lives, whether or not that means getting degrees. We're always supposed to be thinking about the Word of God and the problems and challenges of our modern world and how we can bring those two together. So we have several centers of university study around the world. And in my commission, they're looking also then at projects which aren't quite so institutionalized, but might need a certain global perspective, the governance or vigilance or supervision of the master of the order to coordinate some of these projects. For example, looking at disruptive technologies. Uh, that's the project called Optic Technology. There's also an online Dominican university called Dom Uni. And these projects have been discussed not just in my commission, but also now in the plenary session of fraternal exchanges at the end of the day. So that's a little insight into where we're at with the work of these commissions. They've all presented interim reports, which will now be uh, discussed over the coming three days of the chapter in plenary sessions. And on the side, there's also all the fraternal exchanges and a bit of time to rest, I think, also uh, around the bar and to get to know the Vietnamese brothers who are our gracious hosts here in Vietnam. Last night we were delighted with a concert of Vietnamese traditional music on those traditional instruments by a professional group. And they received a very warm standing ovation at the end. Uh, they sh showcased instruments like the bamboo flute, the monochord zither, and the uh, 16 chord lyre. At the end of the concert, we were all privileged to have the opportunity to try some of these instruments ourselves. So that was a wonderful opportunity to enjoy the Vietnamese culture and the brothers and the other members here who have welcomed us so warmly. Please keep us in your prayers as the work continues and is no doubt going to get heavier in the coming days. Thank you very much from Bien Hoa. <laughs>